Hello beautiful people and welcome back again to OnHow channel. My name is Anas and I'm working for you. So if you have any questions or any video requests, make sure to drop them online comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment. If you are wondering again, why is that? Because simply, I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to change the image banner text color on your Shopify store. So if you are interested in how to change the text color on the image of your banner on Shopify, this video will help you to do so and we will do that without using any apps or anything like that and as well it works for every Shopify team. I already tested it on multiple teams and I will be using down team because I know most people do nowadays and we will do demonstration in front of you and you will see the text color changes obviously and it's really easy and simple and straightforward. You don't have to edit any code or anything like that. I will provide you with the code obviously and as I said in the beginning of the video, I'm working for you. I will provide you my support as well. So if you have any issues with my tutorials or anything like that, just drop me a comment on the particular video that you have an issue with and I will be happy to help you out. But for this video, as I said, I will show you how to change the text color on the banner image for your Shopify store. And I will be demonstration as I said for down team. But I assure you, it works for every Shopify team. And without any more talking, let's just jump to it. But before we start, if this video helped you out, please help me out pressing that like button. I would really appreciate it. It's completely free and it will motivate me to make more videos for you guys. So I would really appreciate it if you hit that like button. Just like the banner says here, as you can see. Just a like please with the sad emoji. <laughs> so make sure to hit that like button. And as you can see, by the way, this is the Shopify store that I do all the tutorials and, and tricks on. And this Shopify store is actually a down team. And as you can see, it has this video banner right here with the text and button, as well as the transparent header with the video playing underneath it, as you can see. And all the things in here, I did show them in tutorials and a lot more, not just these. For example, you know down team, if you want to access the menu in here, you need to click on it. I did show how to actually remove that and do the hover effect by just hovering over with the categories. As you can see, it will show me the menu in here and as well as the sub menu, just like you see right now. So there is a lot of things that showed on my channel that you will not find anywhere else on YouTube. So if you are interested in how to customize your Shopify store to make it unique and branded, make sure to check out my channel. But for this video, as I said, is for changing this text color right here. And this actually will require a different trick that the thing I will show you in this video. Because as I said, I did show how to add this video banner by using a custom code, a custom section that does not exist on Shopify teams. And as I said, that would require a different trick. What I'm talking about in this video is the regular down team that without using this video banner. So let's just close this and access the default one that doesn't have the banner actually, uh, which is this one right here. So let's just click on preview in here and here it is. I'm talking about this one right here. So how to change the color for this one. That's really easy. Let's just get to it. And by the way, you see how the store, the default team looks like when you just uh, install the default down team on your store. This is how it looks like. As you can see, it's really blank with nothing on it. And here is how it looks like after I did all the tricks to customize it, make it unique. You see the difference here? It's pretty huge as you can see. And as I said, if you are interested in how to transform it like this, check out my channel. But for now, let's just stick to the subject. I'm getting drifted again, so I apologize. So let's just access the Shopify dashboard because that's obviously what we need to access. Then we will do the trick and come back here and reload the page and the changes should be visible in here. So let's just access the Shopify dashboard. Then after that, click on the three dots on the left of customize and click on edit code right here then it will take you to the code editor for the Shopify team. And the next thing you're going to do is scroll down and access this assets folder right here. When it says assets, simply click on it and you will see base.css. And either you will find base.css or team.css. But I think uh, most of the teams nowadays use base.css. And as I said again, I repeat, this trick works for every Shopify team. And base.css or team.css exist on any Shopify team. That's actually a must. Shopify team must have this file right here. So let's just click on it. Then it will show you a bunch of code in here. And no worries, you will not edit any code or anything like that. As I said, I will provide you with really simple code that will do the trick. The next thing you're going to do is scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page. Let me drag this down. And here we go. 
after you did access the bottom of the page make sure you are on a completely new line that nothing on it on the bottom of the page then the next thing you're going to do is scroll down the description box and you will see a link named it as code and simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here with a very short code three lines to be exact as you can see <laughs> it's very short so this is the code that will do the magic yes so obviously the next thing you're going to do is right click and copy the code make sure to select the whole code you now when i say the whole code you might think that it's 100 lines it's just three lines so it's not that hard so they just right click copy then we will get back to the base.css and we will paste it at the bottom of the file and that's really important make sure to paste it in a completely new line at the bottom of the base.css so let's just paste it in here next as you see it says color and there is a hex color code in here obviously copy it and access google search engine paste it in here and you will see this widget and this is the color that's set it to so just uh, play around with this and pick the color that you want that you want to change the text for then copy it the hex color by clicking on this button right here and get back in here and replace it as you can see so simply select this and paste in the new one then hit save and after the changes will save it let's just get back to the shopify store in here then we will reload the page and the text to change to the color which is this one purple i think yeah purple so let's just reload the page and see if that will work or not and it will work actually so let's just reload the page and it did get back to the other team so let's just close this i apologize let's just get back in here and let's just do the preview for the down team and here we go so as you can see it did change the text to the purple which is the color that we did change it to and as i said this will work for every team because bait.css or team.css exists on every shopify team and this little code right here will do the trick for every team and just like you saw now it's working just fine so that's how you change the banner image text color on your shopify store and as I said in the beginning of the video, I'm working for you. So if you have any issues or any video requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment or check out my Instagram right here below. I don't reply to each comment. If you are wondering again why is that, because simply I'm working for you. Otherwise, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.